based duty yourself topic tips on how to build wonderful intimate relationship with yourself for real validation to this topic please focus only on the content and ignore my lacunas in pronunciation tone expression accent grammar my looks and even this video's background for the content of this video please ask and if you need tips on any specific topic please let me know claim a free session which also includes couples of mandatory pre-work design to create your future blueprint of action in the areas of personal and professional growth relationships moving on after setbacks breakups failures startup and business success and upscaling overcoming business professional personal challenges with absolutely no strings attached kindly subscribe to this channel and please like the videos which adds value to you plus share this message as well as the videos you like with your near and dear ones to avail please email on the email id given on either of our websites successlimitedmantra.com and relationshipandhappiness.com now coming back to our topic now there are 70 plus tips on how to build wonderful intimate relationship with your own self create few rituals and follow them as non-negotiable commandments wake up little early sit in the nature relax with tea coffee lemon honey water whatever is your pleasure think about one good thing that you have identified in yourself meditate visualizing your future do exercise yoga deep breathing stretching be kind be gentle be compassionate to yourself 16 steps to celebrate being yourself every day ask yourself and focus on how many ways you can discover your talents and use them to add value to yourself and others how can you be your own best friend identify how will you treat yourself today identify which of the people in your circle which person you will interact with who makes you feel come alive who makes you feel great about yourself who will you connect with which toxic people you will get rid of from your life who will you forgive today how will you treat and honor your body with healthy foods today and in this week identify why you are a wonderful person List as many qualities and reasons that you can come up with plus keep adding. Identify at least one new aspect about yourself that increases your respect about yourself and makes you feel worthy. Identify and set intention, tone and goal of how you like to feel about yourself. What type of people you would love to have in your life. Now, what type of life you want to lead. Ask yourself and follow them. Adopt an attitude of curiosity and acceptance. Create a personal crisis plan. Sometimes life deals us a really bad hand or we make a decision which we regret and hate ourselves for. Involve and engage yourself in meaningful and worthy projects, tasks and activities. Work is important and not everyone have a job they love. But it is important to find ways to make it meaningful. Likewise, our life Outside of our work, career and professional areas like hobbies, recreation, relationships and volunteer activities have to be meaningful and confidence boosting. Infuse curiosity in your mind to make it a source of great fascination and entertainment. Create good habits. Start your day in such a way that you increase the likelihood of having a day which supports your self-relationship goals. No one can make you feel happy the way you can make yourself happy. You also need to open up your communications with others and to share how you want to be treated and treat them likewise. Now there are 12 confidence boosting methods. Have fun. Do something you are good at. Do something that makes you feel good doing. Push yourself in the areas that you feel limits you. Take actions in the areas that create fears in you after safeguarding yourself of course. Challenge yourself to go beyond your current abilities. Do things that you are scared of. Give back more than you receive to make you feel wonderful. Value yourself. Stop blaming others as well as yourself. Stop giving or making excuses. Stop playing victim. Start facing the truth and reality and the facts. Take responsibility for resolving conflict, nurturing relationship, building the bridges again, for living a life the way you want to live life, all your decisions, actions and consequences. Try to understand others. Try to give benefit of doubt till you have clarified and verified. Associate 
positive meanings with people if you love them. Meanings have energy. Set healthy boundaries with everyone around you. Practice assertiveness. Practice saying no to others' demands and pressures. Allow yourself to fail. Help others. Volunteer. Experiment. Do something new. Fail with knowledge that as you are trying newer ways, even if you don't succeed, you will learn something new. Avoid social media completely time to time. Stop comparing yourself with others around you, especially based on their social media posting. Understand that caring for yourself is not self indulgence It is self-preservation. Express and talk about your feelings openly. Become vulnerable. Talking about your feelings can help you stay in good mental health and deal with times when you feel troubled. Keep active. Exercise. Eat well. Drink sensibly. Sleep well. Keep in touch socially with people who uplift you. Ask for help without shame. Take break regularly. Go to the mountains, seaside, beaches, anywhere. Identify all your weaknesses, flaws, regrets, mistakes made, shameful incidences, etc. Plus all your positives and good qualities and strengths. Then accept who you are totally and unconditionally. Understand that mental well-being does not mean being happy all the time. And it also does not mean that you won't experience negative or painful emotions such as grief, loss or failure, which are part of normal life. Face your fears, identify what makes you afraid, anxious, scared, then go ahead and do it. Know when to seek help and call for help. Learn how you can help yourself in a positive manner. Now, practice mindfulness by practicing these six things every day. Mindful breathing. Mindful scanning and feeling good about your body and emotion. Mindful walking. Mindful eating. Mindful listening. Mindful observing. Practice being grateful for your body. Let go of your inner perfectionist. Let go of judging others.